Welcome to my channel, Light as a Feather Tarot. This is going to be a pick a card reading, yes or no. So basically you just think of your question and then you pick which group resonates with you. Group one, group two, group three, or group four. Um, it's up to you if you wanna pick one group or if you wanna pick multiple groups with different questions. Keep in mind this is a general reading, so please take the messages that resonate, leave the messages that don't fit. So we're going to go ahead and look at the energy of the cards. I will put all the timestamps below so you can go ahead and move forward which with group that you chose. Okay guys, so we're going to go ahead and get started with group one. So we have Needle Thread, A Sincere Wish Will Be Granted. Beautiful. So we're starting off with the Ten of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles. Ten of Wands, I'm sorry, and the King of Pentacles. Very beautiful energy. So with this, I'm seeing that, you know, you guys are ending some type of completion. You're ending some type of cycle. You know, for some of you guys, you know, this may have been a long time coming, you know, with the Ten of Wands, you know, but this cycle is ending and you're moving from this cycle ending. You're moving into this energy of the King of Pentacles, which is very uh, secure, very confident, uh, very stable, you know, and a wish is being granted, guys. So whatever your question was, I definitely see this as a yes. You know, you may not be at that completion quite yet. But once you once you mark this completion, you are going to move into a more uh, secured energy. So things may seem unclear, you know, the full the, the moon is coming up, you know, Monday is a full or new moon, I, I believe, coming up, you know, and we are in um, Mercury retrograde. So this we're in the last week of the shadow period. So, you know. Things may be unclear. Let this uh, moon energy move out the way. And I really feel like you're going to see this energy comes in of security and uh, wish fulfillment. Look at that. You have completion coming up here. Uh, judgment, some type of rebirth, you know, like a phoenix rising from the ashes. This is a very beautiful energy, you know, some type of transformation you were going through, but it, it but it's coming to an end. And it's really going to lead you into this energy of, of the King of Pentacles, which comes out again. So very, very beautiful. Please comment below. Let me know how these messages are resonating with you guys. And if you would like to see more videos like this. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and look at group number two. So this is a pick a card reading for a yes or no question. All right, so you have Elephant. A long journey, either physical or mental, will leave you wiser at the end. All right. Okay, so we have the Knight of Wands and we have the Five of Pentacles. So with this energy, um, with these cards, I'm getting the energy that um, you may feel a little bit impatient. You may be wanting to move forward. You may be wanting things to change with your finances. Maybe there's some type of lack or lack of love or fulfillment or finances or lack of stability um, with the five of pentacles here. You know, but with the elephant here, you know, a long journey will either physically or mentally um, make you wiser in the end. So because of this impatient energy here, I'm going to say that this is a no or really like not the right time or not right now. You know, I really think that you should f don't focus on the lack, you know, don't focus on um, moving forward so quickly, you know, because spirit is saying that, you know, the universe is is putting things in place, you know, for for, you know, your manifestations to be delivered to you. Um, so they're completely whole, right? You don't want to receive something and the legs and arms are falling off. You want to receive your abundance the way that they're, they're meant to um, come to you. So Spirit, can you clarify? So Three of Wands, yeah. 
you guys want to move forward you guys want to expand you know but spirit is saying that you know there's a longer journey ahead right there's a longer longer journey ahead there's a little bit of patience that needs to um that needs to be had right now because look at this this five of pentacles is going to turn into the ten of pentacles so spirit is saying that you have to be patient you know it's not the right time to make any type of hasty decisions um, in regards to your your question i don't know if maybe you're rushing something financially or rushing the stability of a relationship maybe that person needs time maybe you need to be patient with that person or maybe you just need to be patient with yourself So please comment below let me know how these messages resonate and if you would like to see uh, more videos like this in the future so now we're gonna go ahead and look at group three for pick a card reading yes or no so you have candle you will be shown the way you have rat someone working against you behind your back now this message may not be for everyone Fair woman, dealings or relationship with a woman with blonde, gray, or white hair may be significant for some of you guys. So you have the hair font here, and you have death. So with the hair font here, this speaks about your faith. This speaks about you know some type of commitment. It could speak about some type of large institution. I'm really getting a work energy um with with these cards i feel that i feel that some of you guys may be in some type of work environment um that just may not be healthy i, I especially with rat being here i feel like there's some type of negative energy going around maybe you're dealing with a negative person or negative people you know and I feel like the energy at this company or this large institution, it may be um, causing you to feel a little bit off balance. You know, especially with death here, this is about transformations and endings. For some of you, you know, I feel that, you know, there is going to be some type of ending here. You know, uh, perhaps you leave the job, perhaps you quit, perhaps you're let go. Um, either way, there's going to be some type of ending and some type of moving on. So with these cards, I am getting a no. Um, I feel that there may be a period of uncertainty or things that may not be clear. And it's, it's up to you to really go within and connect with spirit because, you know, spirit is going to show you the way. Spirit is really going to show you how to move forward with success. You know, if you were dealing with any type of negativity as far as um, a person, you know, if this is a relationship or a commitment, you know, if, if, if there's a significant other working against, you know, against you or behind your back or maybe work, you know, you don't you don't need that, you know, because whatever this situation is, whatever this commitment is, whether it's a job or a person, it was really throwing off your balance. So like I was saying, spirit is really going to show you um, your divine path. And with this ending, you're going to be moving forward and you're going to be moving in forward and into balance. All right, guys, so please comment below. Let me know how these messages resonate with you guys. All right, so we're going to go ahead and go with um, group four. So we're starting out with flowers, so happiness, and we have fly, a period of ill health, depression, okay? And that message may not be for everyone. All right, so we're starting off with the nine of wands and the two of wands. So Spirit is saying that, you know, be persistent, don't give up. You know, this is you looking to the future. You know with the two of wands here this is you literally having the world in your hands you know i feel that for some of you if you are going through some type of depression some type of lack or if your health um, is being affected right now you know spirit is saying don't give up you know don't give up the fight keep pushing forward because you know on the on the other side of that you have ha happiness so i definitely see that you know your health is going to improve um if, if you do feel a, a bit depressed you know 
you're gonna have some type of new beginning come in here you know so for a group four this is definitely a yes i'm really feeling like a a healing energy you have a uh, ace of cups here so this is some type of emotional fulfillment your cup being full you know when you don't feel good whether it's mentally or physically you know your cup is is pretty low it's pretty empty because you're either, la either lacking fulfillment or lacking energy you know because when you're right here and you're tired and you're battled and you're you know you're bruised um, bruised from battle you know you don't look towards the future because it's like I'm exhausted you're gonna get some type of new, uh, fresh emotional fulfillment uh, beginning that comes in here. And it's gonna give you that energy boost that you need to look forward to the future. So I, I feel that, you know, with the Eight of Wands, this speaks about the energy just moving faster. So I feel that, you know, like I said, this period of uh, ill health or depression, I feel like things are really going to change. You're at a nine. Literally, you're almost at the completion. You're, you're already over the hill. So this is about messages coming in back and forth. Um, if not messages, these are the energy, the energy really, really moving forward. I just saw the ace of wands, ace of uh, swords at the bottom of the deck. You know, so you guys are going to, you're going to definitely receive some type of clarity. You're going to receive some type of. Um, spark of inspiration you have the two of cups here you may have someone supporting you um, either a, a romantic partner or someone that you have a soul connection with you know so this is a yes answer keep pushing through if, if you are dealing with health issues or um, you know some type of depression or just honestly just being exhausted I mean being tired alone is a lot so guys please comment below let me know how these messages resonate with you if you um, really like the pick a card yes or no readings, um, let me know and I will put up more videos like this. So you guys take care, be safe, and till next time.